On your side received new video from the deputy involved shooting in York County. Now we want to warn you that the video may be graphic. A viewer captured what happened moments after a deputy fired the fatal shots at 26 year old Damien Harrell. That same deputy is seen here tasing a second possible suspect. Ten on your side's Matt Gregory spoke with the York Pocosin Sheriff's Office about this new footage. Matt? Yeah, the sheriff's office says in the video that deputy seen tasing the man is the same deputy who just minutes ago shot Damian Harold to death. But what they say you can't see in the footage or is hard to see is a sheriff's deputy making a split second decision that saved a life. This video came from a viewer while waiting for the scene to unfold. The two deputies demand that the man lay on the ground. When he refuses, you can see the man lift up his shirt. Keep in mind, moments ago, Damien Harrell lifted his shirt and pulled out a gun on this deputy. This man instead is tased. The sheriff's office says the reaction fit the situation, but based on what just happened, the deputy is to the deputy. It's amazing that he didn't shoot. Then he's going towards this guy who then not only got his hands up, won't get on the ground, he pulls his shirt up. So he's lucky that he can get shot. And again, we're glad he didn't get shot. We're proud of the deputy. He did everything he was trained to do. It couldn't have gone any better. Coming up in an hour, we'll talk to the man who shot the footage you just saw. We want to know what he saw and why he started rolling on the video when he did. In Newport News, Matt Gregory, 10 on your side.